It's been seven months since the Patriots last wore pads. That changed today. Training camp today starts now. Welcome into training camp today brought to you by Gillette. I'm Megan O'Brien. The players took the practice field with an extra pep in their step because after a long off season, it was finally the first day of fully padded practices. Now these players have been through countless Zoom meetings, virtual walkthroughs and in-person walkthroughs, but today was the first day we got to see some contact. Now they weren't exactly doing Oklahoma drills out at practice. It seems as though the Patriots are easing their way into these contact practices, but we did get to see some pass rush and pass protection drills. We all know about the opt-outs, eight Patriots elected to opt out of the 2020 season, and that includes right tackle Marcus Cannon. That means there's an opportunity for someone to step up and earn the starting right tackle position. So far throughout camp, there's been a number of players inserted into that spot, including Jermaine Illuminor, Yadni Kajus, Corey Cunningham, and Justin Heron. It's a position that we'll watch throughout camp, but right now, a number of players have been getting an opportunity. Paul Barillo of Patriots.com joins us on training camp today. Paul, an exciting day at Gillette Stadium because it was the first padded practice. What was your biggest takeaway? You know, to me, just to see the guys out there in pads, it's been a long time. Really, you go back to January, the playoff game. It's the last time these guys had shoulder pads on. It's a long time. It was a little rusty, I thought. I, I do think that the coaching staff decided to sort of ease their way into it a little bit. But as you mentioned in the open, you got to see some one-on-ones with the offensive and defensive linemen. So to me, that's a start, and that was a really good sign to see. Was there any particular player who flashed to you? You know, there's a lot of things happening out there. One guy that really is, is popped to me is, is Rex Burkhead. He's a guy that we know a lot about. He's been around. He's been in the system for a few years now. He just looks really fresh to me, uh, really fast. I think he has been the fastest back that the Patriots have had. But certainly on these practices, he has really exploded through the line. Good burst, great jump cuts. We all know the versatility that Rex brings, but he looks really quick to me. And it was one thing to look fast without the pads, but today he did the same while wearing the pads, so a good sign for Burkhead. Thank you, Paul. After practice today, several players met the media, and it was the first time that we got to hear from the reigning Defensive Player of the Year, Stephon Gilmore. Just try to be the same guy and player I am. Uh, just try to put, put in work each and every day. And um, I know what it took last year for, for me to play consistently each and every game. And, you know, it's, it's nothing I can do but just put my head down and work hard and, and, and try to achieve those things each and every game. We were definitely fired up to get back out there and just, you know, test all the preparation that we've been uh, you know, we've been working on different techniques and, and strategies. You can you can talk about that sort of stuff, but until you actually get out there and uh, and do it, you know, it doesn't mean anything. So it was a great first day, and we're looking to you know build off of that moving forward. First fully padded practice in the books. We'll be back with more coverage tomorrow on training camp today.